our wipes in our truck are frozen solid. Hello and good morning from the McNeils. <laughs> Got the cat over here. I came down with a nasty UTI and every time I just like, we caught this one really fast and thankfully it didn't go bad, which is fantastic. But just for those of you women out there who struggle with this, it's real. I feel your pain, literally. And it's such a struggle because I don't even know where this one came from. This time I actually fought it for days. And yesterday was just one of those days where I just felt completely exhausted. Today we have decided to have breakfast supper. So I am mixing up sourdough waffles because they have to sit for most of the day. Usually you do it overnight because most people eat waffles in the morning, but we love breakfast supper. How about you? If you like breakfast supper, comment down below. I am mixing up some sourdough waffles and then Clancy and I are actually going on a date to Walmart because we've decided to try and get a jump start on stocking stuffers and things like that pulling stuff in so that we don't have to stress when it comes down to the last days of shopping all of the noises the girls watch in morning cartoons they have this new prank show that they love things on the list to do today. I have taken down our fall decor. It's all gone off the top of the piano. We've got it all boxed up. We have had to pull absolutely everything out of our garage because of the fact that we have mice. They are all of a sudden getting in there. Clancy took all of our file boxes because it's super easy for the mice to get into those and he pulled those all inside. He had some help with that. We are in the process of trying to eradicate mice and one of those methods is putting Nala out in the garage because she loves chasing them and she's actually caught two of them, but they have made a mess absolutely everywhere and there's a huge amount of cleanup to do out there. You can see the mess. It's just everywhere, all over the shelf. So we've had to empty the shelf off. We've been trying to just clear out anything. We took the dog food and the cat food out of here, but this is the whole garage basically, including even the helmets. You can see there's stuff in there. So I've had to bleach wipe the kids' helmets and wash them out. We actually need to take them out of here completely. Mice are so frustrating to get rid of, especially in a space like this with all of your storage stuff out here. We think that they might be coming in underneath the seal on the door. So Clancy is going to work at replacing that. It's just, like, it's just so frustrating. I am thankful that they're not in the house because that's even worse, but it is a mess out here and we have to figure out how to get rid of them. We're going to buy some mouse traps. We already have these little electronic things going over here. Let me show you. We have this one. You can see the red light flashing on the side showing that it's on. That one puts out an, a noise. It just emits a high pitched noise. So does this one. These ones don't seem to work very well. As you can see, they've been plugged in and there's mouse droppings all around them. So far, this seems to be our best method of attack. Hi, hey, kitty. Go catch mice. One of the other things on the list for today is to... <laughs> I just explained, all the boxes are in here. <laughs> <laughs> we are actually sitting down to look at and order the things from Ikea that we went and looked at the other day so that we can get all of that in the basement because then we can get the carpet in there, which is the step that I think I'm most excited for. The walls were exciting, but I'm super excited to actually get carpet in there and get it to be a space that the kids can go to on the cold days and the days that they're just going nuts and they need somewhere to go. It's a real issue right now, supply and demand. Ikea doesn't have the color that we want. We want everything to be white and we can get it in brown or black and you can't even order it until they have it in stock. So we are going through each of the different ones we saw that could work one by one, trying to find one that has the right color. This is Aydanos. <laughs> Do you speak Swedish? Cause I don't. Well, Clancy and I were super busy. <laughs> they were super busy. I created skydiving. Okay, yeah, show us. Hey, the big drop. <laughs> it's fun. I just got a ticket for jumping. You're right. It's not skydiving. It's bungee dump jumping, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. We're doing a bottle depot run 
to get rid of all of anything that could possibly attract mice into our garage. We sat them outside for a couple of days to make sure that there are no mice in the bins because we don't want mice in our truck because we've had that happen before. And it could possibly be worse than having mice in your garage. What do you think? Is mice in the vehicle worse than mice in the garage? They're both bad. <laughs> They're both bad. I think though mice in the trailer is the worst. That, that tops it for me. Anyway, we're going to go do this and all of our IKEA wishes and dreams can't come true because they don't have the right color. So we're also going to run to Home Depot and see if we can possibly pick up some of the boards and we're going, going to buy the stuff to custom make a cabinet to cover over our electrical panel. Sometimes the words are hard and they take a minute. all of our bottle money and putting it in a container we still are it's actually our Disneyland container but as you know if you've been around here for very long we actually got rid of our Disneyland tickets because it just doesn't seem like it's going to work out for an extended period of time and we also bought tickets for Bailey and Kieran and we have no idea if they will be able to even go with us by the point that we are able to go the money is still going in the container in hopes that at some point in time we will be able to go Clancy wants a wipe but this is a, a cold weather problem. Our wipes in our truck are frozen solid. That moment when you realize that you have absolutely no clue what type of paintbrush to get. Clancy wants the $80 mouse trap with Wi-Fi so you get a notification on your phone if you've caught something. So will you leave your ringer on at night so oh, yeah. that... <laughs> Who knew that there were so many options? I didn't help buy traps last time when we had them in the trailer in the truck. These are our, our IKEA alternatives here. We might need two of these, one to go on either side of the panel and then some shelves. We also just put all of the mouse trap stuff back after making those massive executive decisions on how we're going to kill mice because we're actually going to Walmart because it's Kieran's discount day and we figured that we can probably do better there. So we didn't make any big choices on what to do to cover our electrical panel. We took a look and then it's just trying to decide if we can do a really good job of it and make it look really nice or if we're better off to spend the extra money and buy a cabinet that is fully finished and will look even better in that space. Buying one is cheaper. Okay. So then we just need to find one to buy. We are going to head into Walmart and we're going to try and get as much stuff off of our Christmas list as we possibly can. I did mention, I think in the previous vlog, that we like to buy our kids something to read, something to do, something that they need, but we also try to keep Christmas fairly small. I'm not gonna take you in with me because the kids may watch the vlog and there's no way that I want them to see what we're getting them for Christmas. <laughs> like an hour and a half that took us to get through there but with Kieran's discount we saved over a hundred dollars yes 20 percent which is awesome so we got like all sorts of stocking stuffers a couple of gifts for the girls it feels like we're like accomplishing something and getting stuff done here so now we have to take it all home and the kids can't really help us take it in the house because there's stuff in it that they can't see we got some advent calendars and so some of them are just just regular groceries we are going to head out for a walk it is not very often that we get weather that is at least 11 degrees it might be a little bit warmer in november usually by now it is cold it is snowing we're going to take the dog for a walk we have our stuff all hidden up in our room i was going through it though and i did happen to find a jug of yogurt that had made it in there and it probably wouldn't have been really fun to find a jug of yogurt a week or so before Christmas about the time that I start wrapping presents so I was really thankful that I did look through that Bike path. Yes, I'll go on it. 
got those waffles finished off. We have whipped cream and homemade strawberry sauce, which I can link back into vlogs a while ago. Kids eating because it's movie night. Look at her sleep. Oh my goodness. Oh, and Caden. He already finished his one with strawberries and he's going for savory. I usually mix together with strawberries. Yeah, that's fair. Good stuff.